Today, we're going to be testing multiple different doomsday bunkers against tsunamis. Let's get started. All right, guys, here it is. The first bunker we're going to be using today. So we already did make a bunker video, but today we're going to be testing it against tsunamis. Last one we did was actually against meteors. That one was pretty insane. All right, we're in the bunker. Moment of truth. How good will it look? Okay, we're in the bunker. Where are the lights? Okay, lock doors and lights. Oh, we can actually like have a lock. All right, so here we are in a bunker. We have a little camera room here. We're going to run through a bit of a tour before we spawn in the tsunami. We actually have a advanced camera out here that we can track the tsunami with and zoom in on it and get some high quality pixelized images yes of course and then let's see what's down here this is a pretty big bunker i'm pretty sure i saw it on workshop so we have more stairs okay right here's our medical base so this is where you go if you get sick at guys i am never going to be in there i'm built different all right here's the cafeteria and we can turn on the lights oh my gosh this actually looks like a bunker cafeteria like there's no windows it looks like a prison kind of also and we're gonna go down here to the also cafeteria no i think this is the kitchen right here so this is where we can make all of our food at oh yeah they got a subway set up of course pretty cool and then they have like a walk-in freezer of some sort um okay so now it goes even farther down oh my gosh okay let's turn on some lights all right so if we go even farther down we have a generators room dude these are some powerful looking generators we're gonna turn them on right now because you know we got an emergency going on so generators are going on i'd really like to build myself a doomsday bunker that honestly sounds really fun building a bunker oh we should really do that okay so right here it says notice please report any injuries to uh found in the facility um okay i'll do that and then we have our bedroom here so this is where we're sleeping oh wow looks really relaxing in here with no windows honestly a little bit creepy but you know that's fine it's not really made for like luxury you know it goes even deeper uh, how deep are we oh my gosh i don't know what kind of construction they had to do for this bunker but this thing goes down deep okay here we go this is the maintenance room right here another maintenance room with a hallway and locked locked oh that one's not locked equipment oh okay okay and then right here we have a locked thing but let's go behind the locked door what is this oh oh my gosh what did we just enter hold on wait what um okay uh what is this ventilation units oh oh my gosh this looks like a nuclear like silo or something like that you know um the thing they launch missiles out of okay well that's really interesting i don't know exactly what this is but we can go to the bottom here wait a second is that the seafloor that is the seafloor what in the world okay well that's the exterior of the bunker if you were wondering all right so let's get this started let's spawn it in the tsunami right now so we're gonna click spawn tsunami and it will be here any minute so we're gonna go on the camera seat right here and i do some circles see where this thing's actually coming from we'll definitely be able to see it but over here we have some lemonade stands or something of some sort oh my gosh this camera has really good zoom let's zoom in as far as we can on that like pot right there let's zoom in on it oh my god dude what kind of camera is this this must be so much money okay well we're looking for a tsunami right now so let me know if you guys actually see anything i'm not seeing anything yet um all these trees are kind of blocking it wait what in the world look at the trees guys they're like really starting to shake that normally means like a tsunami or a hurricane's coming okay so we're gonna zoom out here kind of keep looking for it a lot of people talk crap about the monitor quality in this game and i can kind of see where they're coming from i can like count pixels on oh, this a little bit concerning but the wind is going that way so it's going over there so that must mean the tsunami should be somewhere over wait what the heck is that do you guys see that oh oh we are tracking a massive tsunami going towards our bunker right now oh look at that thing we got a super zoom camera in oh my gosh that thing is coming in hot okay so a tsunami is going towards our bunker right now i hope this thing's water sealed that's basically what we're going to be testing i'm pretty sure it is it's nuclear you know it's a doomsday bunker it has to be sealed you know all right here it is crashing straight over mainland we're gonna see it like completely engulf this building right here that's gonna be interesting um we are on our super zoom camera right there oh oh gosh okay here's a third person view that is insane holy all right yeah it's not looking too good here from the inside i'm a little bit concerned oh my gosh it's gonna start crashing over that building right there here it is starting to completely engulf that building oh gosh okay here we go oh we're underwater okay let's see what's going on in here everything good i think we're all good in here yep i think we're all good even right here is waterproof um yep we're completely underwater everything's looking good we are so deep right now oh my gosh dude there must be like water seeping in from the bunker somewhere like there's no way there's not water down here any water um there's no water even the deepest part we go i don't think we're gonna see any water down here yeah so we're in the deepest part of the bunker right now not a drop of water we're completely fine down here that's a really good test though this thing did survive moving on to the next doomsday bunker fitted with anti-air cannons and a massive radar dish all right so let's go ahead and actually teleport in this thing so here it is the entrance you have to actually click this and it teleports you oh my gosh look at this thing with their cool light bulb things all right so this is a control room right here we did use this in the last video we have a emergency lockdown thing right there actually it's not lockdown it's just like an emergency but right here we actually have turret controllers and we can shoot at everything we have a zoom that we can probably shoot at our own radar with oh we probably should not have just done that okay you know anyways that is completely fine do we have like a radar operator um oh a cctv okay that's even better honestly but yeah so right here is our radar operator that's our radar on top of the mountain this is like a norad type radar it has a crazy view like we can see the entire map i don't have any ai spawned in so there's 
not going to be anything. But if I did, there'd be green dots all the way over here and it'd be pretty crazy. So, yep, that's basically this area over here real quick. All right, so here we have the kitchen and the little gaming area with a whole bunch of bookshelves. Oh, yeah. And then down this massive hallway right here, we have, oh, enter the garage. Okay, I don't know. I right, So we're in a garage right now. Is this above ground garage? Oh, um, wait, what's going on? What's going on? Oh, we're flooding. Um, wait, okay. I think we're going to be closing this for now. We're going to be closing. Nope. Close the garage. I don't know what the heck is out there. Um, we are completely flooded. Uh, did we do that underwater? Hold on. What's going on out here? Oh, the tsunami's going over. Okay. So the, the garage isn't waterproof. We know that. Um, well now it's kind of like seeping out of those cracks right there. It should be going down. It's yep. It's spilling out of the garages. That's so insane looking. Wait, um, it trapped the water in there. Hold on. Oh, nice. So now we have a indoor swimming pool. So now what we're going to do is open this so we can finish spilling out of my garage here because we're completely flooded our bunker currently not happening and there we go it's all spilling out perfect so right over here we have our batteries and our two generators we can start them up real quick we're just going to start them just because we will have a tsunami going us over here any second then we have all of our circuit breakers so security rooms weapon rooms medical kitchen and family room bedrooms and vehicle garage under construction wait that's under construction okay whatever we were just in was under construction supposedly i think it was um i don't know then over here we have the grand medical bay oh yeah looking nice in here i like all the details they added in this thing oh yeah so let's go down this hallway dude we're in like a maze right now i don't even know where i'm at so right here we have three bedrooms all the same thing on that side all right we're getting alerts from our norad radar that a tsunami is coming to hit our bunker that is not happening all right so we have our super zoom camera here uh it is actually our anti-air cannon so we're gonna try finding like the tsunami and where it's at and maybe even try shooting at it because you know of course we can do that we don't want to waste all of our ammo because i just realized we only have 38 of that all right tsunami tsunami where is you at so okay that's some trees over there um i'm not seeing anything besides mountains right Right now no tsunami in sight that's probably good but if we zoom in on the trees they are shaking okay so something's definitely going on out there um what's over here tsunami oh yeah look at that radar dude that thing is powerful wait what the heck do you guys see that behind it uh we are tracking a additional tsunami going towards our bunker we can see the current peak of the tsunami dude that thing is crashing over mainland here okay um we're gonna be activating emergency mode here okay activating emergency unlock here we go emergency is on oh we got them dark lights oh they are blinking too any sirens um oh they're definitely a sirens okay we're gonna turn that down that sounds really weird all right so we have an active emergency we've activated all of our emergency sirens we have an active tsunami currently crashing over mainland breaking news everyone brace for a collision we have a major oh my god look at that thing oh it's completely crashing over okay this is going to be very interesting we're gonna turn down our game volume because those are the loudest sirens ever oh here we go it's about to go over us any second now it's about to spill into the train track little um valley right there all right, here we go. We're about to be underwater here any second. Oh, there it is. Here we go. Maybe in a couple seconds here. Um, okay, let's go in our seats. And we are underwater. All right, so this is what it's like to be underwater. Um, yeah, it's completely fine down here. I mean, it's not bad. It's not really that bad. Okay, so this is our radar dish right here. Wait, which part of the bunker is underwater? I mean, there's no water down here. That's all that matters. Like, it's completely dry. This thing is a complete doomsday sealed bunker. So I'm not really expecting anything to, like, go through, really. Um, CCTV is looking good. Nothing no water going on no water spilling through any of our bunkers which is probably better off here um we're not detecting anything we're gonna try shooting at it here we go shoot at the tsunami it's completely crashing over us oh i don't know if this is really working that well yep our gun overheated okay well tsunami does not care all right well i would say it's pretty sealed in here i mean it's factory sealed brand new bunker 2023 oh yeah so here it is yeah basically pretty good all right so remember that first bunker right here yep that's the doomsday bunker there is a additional one right here facing the coast too so we're going to be able to see the tsunami. Actually, we can't. There's no like actual um cameras or anything in this one. So this one might be a little bit questionable. We'll have to go in photo mode and try working it out like that. But let's enter our bunker here. Um, It is filled with grass. Okay, we're going to go with that. Close that door. And we are in this bunker. So I'm pretty sure this is like the one person bunker. Um, Yeah, so we're going to turn on our TV here. Air pumps are on and toggle that button. Secret, find the key. Okay, we might have to do that. But wait, but we're going to tour this thing and kind of like tour the actual stuff in here. All right, so how do we turn on the lights? There's It's like really dark in here. Okay, um, lock door okay so we're gonna close the door and lock it there we go now this thing is sealed okay i want lights in here okay light there we go that's like the worst light ever anyways we got ourselves a bed a hazmat suit okay i'm gonna put that on it is a doomsday bunker i mean is this a doomsday this thing could not survive a nuke no way um it's not deep enough for that but yeah we have a little pistol in here we can shoot at stuff oh yeah see it does work a working pistol in this thing with a nice tv and a picture of a um 
person with, I don't know. And then we have our air pump in here. So that's where we get our oxygen from with some um, AC systems in here, uh, microwave, countertops, and a working stove that doesn't work. Okay, never mind. Then we can eat our food that um, activates a light. Okay. All right, we're going to spawn in the tsunami once and for all. Okay, tsunami is on. So we have to wait in here and try to, we're just going to kind of chill in here. Look for the secret button. So where could it be? It's normally like under stuff. Secret button. Um, Secret button behind like a radiator, maybe like between that crack right there. Um, I don't think so. No. Oh, it's behind the bed. It has to be. Oh, there it is. Okay, secret button. The key is being activated. There we go. Um, We are clicking it right now. Completely unlocked. Okay, secret. Okay, what does the secret do? Three, two, one. All right, secret has been pressed. Oh, um, we just lost all electricity. That is a very cool secret. I love that so much. Wow. Well, now we're definitely screwed. Um, This, yeah, we're dead in here. There's no way. Okay, so what? So my flashlight doesn't work. We've lost all of our electrical. Everything's at zero. Um, That's lovely. Okay, hopefully these turn back on. I'm a little bit concerned right now. Well, while our electric is at zero, we're going to go in third person. There we go. So let's see. Any tsunamis? Oh, I think I see it right there. You guys see that? Oh, gosh. Yep, that's definitely it right over there. It's completely going towards us. Oh, no. Oh, there we go. Air pumps. There we go. Now we have oxygen in here. Can we activate it again? We clicked it again. Um, Will that do anything? I don't know. I hope it doesn't. Um, I don't think it'll work again, though. Yeah, it was just a one-time thing. Okay, we're going to turn that off. I don't know why that's a secret, but that's um quite interesting. Okay, camera mode. That thing is going to be plowing through this village right here. It already did, actually, a couple of minutes ago on our first round. Completely crashing over them trees. Dude, that thing is just ripping this forest apart. These tsunamis do not play around, guys. Okay, so Doomsday Bunker versus a tsunami. I don't know if this is exactly Doomsday. I don't think this thing could survive a nuke, like, at all for some reason. It just doesn't really look like it could. Um, Okay, yeah, I don't know what that is. Uh-oh, here we go. It's starting to crash over the village. Uh-oh, what's gonna happen? There's a boat right there. I wonder if it'll float. Okay, it's not floating. Okay, we are in our bunker. Oh! Um, we left the door open, but that shouldn't even be flowing it either way. We are flooding in here. Um, this is really bad, guys. This is terrible. What do you even do in this situation? I have player damage on too, so we will drown if this thing keeps filling up. Okay, this is not a factory sealed bunker, guys. It's not looking too good for us. All right, Tsunami is past us, but now we have a water filled bunker that we cannot drain because it doesn't have a bilge pump in here or any like leaking stuff. Yeah, so a cool little indoor swimming pool, I guess you could say. So we are going swimming in our hazmat suit. Oh, yeah, well, that's this bunker. Let's go switch to the next one all right next up we are on this deserted island in the middle of nowhere not really we can see like mainland over there and then the little spy cakes island over there all right so yeah not the middle of nowhere so this is the bunker right here it is not a doomsday bunker it's actually an air raid bunker but we're gonna be testing it against the tsunami i think we'll do fine all right so here we go we climb down the bunker these bunkers are really confusing okay so we go that climb down here all right so this is the bunker right here with a crazy um incline right there for stairs um this is an airlock compartment so we have our meeting room right here oh this is like look at the those doors dude those things are thick doors those things do not play around but all right in the meeting room we have some highly confidential stuff that is said in here um lights are blinking on let's activate our tv here so hope you have a meeting plan it says oh that's really okay great then right here we have a rotate seat that's actually really cool so you can like step out of it so, so let's say we're gonna have a meeting i'm gonna get in my seat here get in it rotate it back in and then if i want to leave the seat i'll rotate it and step out oh how cool is that all right so let's get out of this room we've had enough meeting we have the best bathroom oh i really like this flooring in here why do the lights do that they like blink so aggressively okay so we are going to go in our bunks room now we have a cool stormworks picture right there okay bunks room um, we're gonna leave all these doors open see if uh these are actually not waterproof rooms because if they're not waterproof we will see water actually spill through them that's gonna be interesting um so we have our electrical room right here with a uh, do we have any generators prepare to evacuate oh it's right here okay main lights heaters air pumps all right everything's on there we go um so we have a game room in here oh my gosh okay we're gonna turn on the lights in here it's our blinking on all right so we have our game room here with this person a very interesting looking person telling us that we're about to get nuked um don't mind what he's talking about backflips and more okay great so we have our microwave chicken right here of course and then a working refrigerator oh yes i love these okay so it's so you don't actually see working refrigerators a lot in this game so yep working refrigerator and then what is this um then we have a working a table right here and we can shoot and it does work oh yeah okay so let's go to the next room here but yeah it's basically the main long hallway right here oh yeah storage room back here let's actually spawn the tsunami in. i just collected six thousand dollars from that crate all right spawn tsunami three two one here we go tsunami is being 
spawned in. Oh, yeah. So does this one have any like exterior cameras? Um, oh, I forgot we're on an island. Nope, that is not a camera. Oh, wait, that is a camera. Hold on. There's a periscope somewhere in this bunker. So where do we actually control that periscope at? Is there like a specific room we actually control that in? Dude, I thought I've went into every room. I don't know where it's at. Um, medical bay. No, it's not in there. All right. While we're waiting, we're going to be activating our bunker door. Oh, wait, this is it right here. So we're going to close our bunker door. Here we go. Bunker door. And oh, it closes this door. This is a blast door right here. Made for keeping the nuclear bomb stuff out in this area over here instead of over here. So we should be fine here. We have our camera. So we'll definitely be able to see when the tsunami goes over. But we can't do anything really with the camera. But that's completely fine. But the tsunami is coming from directly behind us. So we really won't be able to see this one coming. Hopefully this mountain takes a, a bunch of the actual momentum away from our bunker. But we're going to see. All crew and residents in the bunker currently brace for collision. We have an active tsunami going towards the bunker right now. This is going to be an epic tsunami. All right, here it comes. We're going to go no clip inside the bunker because I did teleport out there just to see kind of what it looked like. So this is the blast area right here. I'm a little bit concerned that this area will fill up with water, but we're going to see. All right, so let's go over here. Let's just keep looking at our CCTV. So the wave should start crashing over that area right over there. Um, I, we can't see the wave at all yet. Oh, there it is. Oh, we're completely under. Um, Let's see over here. Oh, we are filling up with water. Oh, um, guys, we are taking on water in here. Um, We're going to keep this door shut, I think. Okay, close that door. I really hope it's waterproof. Oh, gosh, guys, this is really bad. We're still underwater. Um, so what do we do in this situation? Oh, gosh, this is really bad. Okay, it's filling up. Is there any water down here? I'm not seeing anything. I think we're fine. Oh, there it is. Okay, it just ended. All right, we are alive down here. Oh, my gosh. Okay, we did survive. There's still water in here, though. I don't know if this one survived. So I would say if I had to choose a bunker, I would go with the first one because the first one actually did pretty good. But that's probably going to be it for this video. Let me know if we should do some more stuff with the bunkers. Make sure you guys like and subscribe, hit that bell, join the Discord. Link is in the description. But thanks for watching and goodbye.